Hey ladies and gentlemen, Depose Slew here. Just thought I'd show you my pipe collection. Since I'm doing reviews on pipesandcigars.com, might as well show you my pipes. The first two up here are my kind of no-name pipes. These are sold under the Wellington label. Kind of nondescript. Got a uh, pretty <coughs> distinguishable um, mouthpiece on them. Uh, they are in fact made in Italy. They say that, right? Right here. That's the uh, blasted pipe. And uh, the smooth pipe. They say Italy on them, so they must be made by somebody in Italy. Uh, they smoke pretty good, but these are my kind of junk pipes. Although, they have a very, very wide bowl. I would say that's an inch. Pretty deep. They smoke pretty good. But those are my junk pipes, I guess you could call them. Uh, probably use them while I'm riding the motorcycle. After I started smoking those two, when I came back to smoking tobacco, I picked this one up. It's got a nice smooth grain to it. It's called a St. Cloud. This one has a black mouthpiece to it. As you can tell, I'm more prone to the bent stem pipes. I've never cared too much for a straight pipe. But it's got a nice grain to it, a couple of fills in there. And nice and wide bowl to it. Smokes really good. Then I picked this one up. This is my Joby pipe. I've always kind of preferred Joby pipes because they have a, a threaded tenon that goes in. <coughs> And there's what's called the Joby link in the stem. If you ever break that stem off, you can replace that tenon with the Joby link. And boy, it's got a beautiful lucite mouthpiece to it. You know, uh, you really can't tell what the grain is like on one of these, but it's black and nice stained red rim to it and this one's nice and wide too and it's a nice compact pipe you can stick it in your vest pocket coat pocket nice and small not real big like that one there too then I heard about La Silvana pipes nice billiard bowl with a nice thick stem to it lucite bit uh, these are nice deep bowls, good for a nice long smoke, something you can really hang on to. Smooth finish to it, this one here. I got that one and then I had to have the blasted one. Got beautiful wood grain on the, on the stem here and that says La Silvana. Actually got these from tinderbox.com this was an exclusive brand that they had picked up so far I have no complaints the, the bowls are a little bit thinner narrower than these over here and I just got a Peterson pipe nice big brandy bowl with a flat bottom a sitter it's got a nice black acrylic stem to it with a P on it. It's a not real wide bowl, but boy, it is deep. Haven't smoked this yet. Got that from pipesandcigars.com, as I did all of those four right there. And if you saw my latest video when I ordered this one, along with the freebies. I got a Missouri Meerschaum pipe from Washington, Missouri. I don't even know how you break one of these in. I could barely get my little finger in that bowl. 
but it is a corn cob pipe. It's got the honey colored bit on it. Straight stem. Jeez, I used to see these in the drug stores when I was just a little guy, you know, eight, ten years old. Saw these sticking up behind the counter. <laughs> Missouri Meerschaums. I might just save that as a curio. I don't think I'll ever smoke it. Anyway, there you go. The post slew. I have two hobbies. Shooting and smoking a pipe. I'm not going to tell you what my habits are. That's, uh, that's personal. Just want to say that God has blessed me. I pray that God blesses you. And I hope you all have a Merry Christmas. I don't know if I'll do any more videos this month. But just in case I don't. Happy Holidays to all of you. And I pray that your new year is the best you have ever had. I'm out.